Hello my crafty friends. In today's video I'm going to start a new series and this is where I'm going to be working in my 10 minute time limit to show you the process of how I made my 10 on the 10th Christmas cards. This is the process of the cards that I just showed you recently and so let's get started. Okay, I'm using Operation Ride Home Sketch, number 258. I love it because it's got the little banners. I will be using my Banner Punch and the Holly Jolly Wishes set. And for my pattern paper, this is called Evergreen. It's just got several beautiful watercolored pieces in it. And so I chose three and I'm going to be doing the matting a five and a quarter by four piece it's already I already cut that's going to be my matting and then I'm going to cut and mix and match these pieces I'm going to be using this for the inside I'll stamp that with garden green but I will be stamping it's the most wonderful time of the year and we wish you Merry Christmas with my cherry collar slash real red mix. I cannot find my real red stamp pad for some reason. Okay, let's put everything away and put 10 minutes on the clock. And I'm going to go ahead and cut my pieces. Start. Okay. I'll probably just get the cutting done today. This is non-directional. So I'm going to go three and three quarters by five. Ten cards. Quarters. Three and three quarters. Right. Okay. Got it. By five. I'm going to take this same piece and do a three and a quarter by two and a half. Three and a quarter by two and a half. Find out. No, not quite. Okay. That's not either. Okay, now let's take our second sheet. I'm just going to do three and three quarters by five. use these on top of the matting pieces and then I'm going to use the rest that I'm going to use the plaid pieces for the inside 
three and three, three and a quarter by two and a half. That's probably not going to be big enough. Let's see. One, two, three, four, three and three quarters by two and a half. Take our plaid piece. And three quarters by five. Thank goodness they're all non-directional. Quarter by two and a half. left over I can decorate the inside of the garden with. Okay, now I'm going to take, this is going to be the white sentiment piece in the middle, three by two and a quarter. Down here. Okay. I think that's a nice contrast there. Assemble the card front first and then put them on the card bases.
those holly leaves so pretty. Okay, there is our timer. Okay, so we have all of our pieces cut out and we have four, five started. And then next time I'm going to be using my tree die. That's what I'm gonna put where this star is here. And I think that'll be really, really cute. And the sentiment's going to go here. We'll see if we can get to that next time also. Thank you so much for joining me, and I hope to see you again next time. Bye-bye.